last year's winning class, the sophomore class of 1954, Serenade in Silver. And now the sophomores will take the stage. Sophomores didn't waste any time in escorting their girl accompanist to the twin grand pianos. They whisked them up in a hurry, and the chords will be forthcoming quickly now.
the sophomores, singing on the stage their entry in the freshman glee. Sophomore song, the class of 1954, words by Margie Leonard, music by Edna Hill, formation by Jim Hitchman, the song's title, Serenade in Silver. Her formation was truly outstanding. The maroon W superimposed on the yellow moon, superimposed on the blue background. But that formation is melting away now as all 131 of them leave the stage as quickly as they took the stage. And now it's three down, with only one to go. All of these songs and the presentation of them are entirely student effort. No faculty contribution to freshman glee. They write their own songs, arrange them, train themselves to sing them with their own student directors, conductors if you prefer. Entirely a student effort. Ago, we were talking about uh, 180 original songs that have been composed for Glee through the years here in Willamette. Uh, oddly enough, a sidelight to that, the school's most popular song to this day, called I Love Willamette You. It's a school serenade song, which is sung by all the students all the time. It was a Glee loser when it was first composed. It definitely did not win. In fact, it lost Glee. I Love Willamette You, and it's lived all these years. And that's happened with a few other of the titles that are sung here on the campus. Nothing left but uh, maroon sweaters and white skirts and trousers now. They've come to the front level. They've turned away from each other, divided in the middle. A double line, quick step off the two steps at the extreme edges of the six-level stage at the end of the gymnasium.